Welcome viewers, my name is Faraz Parekh and I'm so excited to bring you the first ever episode of our brand new game show, Quizcoms, brought to you by Ziauddin College of Media Sciences. The purpose of our show today is to make learning more enjoyable for our entire audience and for that we've got schools coming in from all over the country to go head to head in a sometimes friendly and sometimes not so friendly competition to see which school has the greatest skill sets. The way the competition works is that it's broken into three different segments. The first segment is trivia. The second segment is a bit tougher, trivia plus. And the third segment is entertainment. Let's get right into it. We've got two fantastic teams here today. Let's go meet our contestants. Team A, tell us a little bit about yourself. What school are you from? What's your favorite subject? And of course, what's your name? My name is Sayyid Abdul Rahman and I am from Reeds College and my favorite subject is General Knowledge and Maths. Amazing. Manur Beg from Reeds College and my strongest subjects are Science and General Knowledge. Such a pleasure to meet both of you. Uh, how do you feel being on the show here today? It's been a great experience. Let's see how it goes. Excellent, excellent. Do you think you have what it takes to beat Team B in today's competition? Yes, I think we could also win this competition. That's some confidence right there. Let's move over to Team B and see what they have to say. Team B, tell me a little bit about yourselves. Name, favorite subject and your school's name. Uh, my name is Hassan Nasir and I'm from Roots Millennium College. My favorite subject would be law and music. Very nice. My name is Aisha Suhela and I'm an A student from Roots Millennium College. My strength subject would be knowledge. Excellent. After hearing what Team A has had to say, do you feel like they will win the competition or you guys have what it takes to demolish them? Definitely us. Well, those are some fighting words right there by Team A and Team B. Let's see what happens as we move forward in the competition. The way the first segment works, it's called trivia and it's broken into four different categories. So join me on the screen behind me and let's have a look at what exactly those categories are. The first category is science, the next one is history, the next one after that is math and then general knowledge. Each segment is broken into different point levels, 10, 20, and 30. As the point levels go up, the questions get more difficult. So um, let's get right into it. Let's get started and walk over to the spinner and see who gets to choose first. It is team a, it's team A. Look at that. It was a close one. I think the spinners also saying that this competition is going to be a little tight. Let's see how team A performs. What's your choice team A? What would you like to start with? General knowledge. General knowledge for how many points? For 10 points. General knowledge for 10 points, please. The luster of diamond is due to what? <laughs> team A has buzzed first. What is the uh, it's answer? It's due to total internal infraction. That is absolutely correct. Well done, Team A. Please choose again. General knowledge, 10 marks. Already done. You'll have to take another pick. How, about, how about 20 points? Make it a little bit tougher if you like general knowledge. Can you see General knowledge, 20 marks. Let's make it happen. General knowledge for 20 points. Which desert is located in the eastern part of Punjab? So now team A, you've buzzed first before the question was done. That means you can't answer. Team B automatically gets the opportunity to answer without any negative marking. So you have to wait. Next time you have to wait till I'm done before you answer the question. Team B, please take your shot. Almost done. And that is the right answer. Very well done, Team B. Points go to Team B. Perfect. Well done. Team B, what's your choice? General knowledge. Again, general knowledge is a popular subject area. Yeah. General knowledge for 30 points. Name the fish delicacy of Japan 
that requires a special license to prepare due to its lethal toxins. Which team knows this? Let's see which one buzzes first. Both teams are stumped. Five seconds on the clock. Four, three, two. Nobody's got the answer. The question is gone. The correct answer is the fugu fish. Fugu fish is the right answer. That is correct. All right. So team B, you had picked the last question. Nobody got the answer. It was a tough one. We'll let it slide. 30 point level. Let's let them choose again. Please take another shot. General knowledge. General knowledge is all complete. You guys are going to have to try something different. We'll go for maths for level 10. Maths level 10, please. How many degrees are there in a right? Team B buzz first, but before I was done answering, that means you lose the opportunity to answer. Look at that. They're making it so easy for each other. <laughs> Team A, you get to take a shot. Free one at that. 90 degrees. That is absolutely correct. Well done, Team A. Well done. Take another choice. Science for 10 marks. Science for 10 points, please. Let's have our question. K is the chemical symbol for what? Potassium. Potassium, very good. Excellent answer, Team B. Take your choice. Let's move forward. Uh, Math for 20 points. Math for 20 points. Let's have our question. How many sides does a heptagon have? Team B has buzzed first. Seven. Are you sure of that answer? Yes, sir. 100 percent yes sir that is absolutely correct amazing team b fantastic job let's get the points on the board team b you've got 50 points at this point team a you've got 20. all it takes is one question and you'll be back in the game team b what is your choice go for history for 10 marks history for 10 marks please Who was the first president of the USA? Team George A. George Washington. Fantastic answer, Team A. That was absolutely correct. And that brings us to the end of segment one. Please join us shortly after a small break. Thank you. Are you interested in news writing? Photography? Storytelling? Drawing, sound and music. ZComs offers specializations in film and TV, communication design, journalism, and a brand new specialization in digital marketing. Consider joining Ziauddin College of Media Sciences, located at Ziauddin University, Clifton. For details and admissions, log on to our website or contact on the numbers given below. Welcome back from the break, viewers. That was a really tough and difficult round one. First Team A stumbled, then Team B stumbled. But let's look at what the point totals are right now and where we stand in the game. Team A currently has 30 points and Team B stands at 50 points. Team A, can you tell us a little bit what is your strategy in this next round to catch up and potentially beat Team B? We're just going to go with the flow and see what yes. uh, comes away. Let's see what the universe sends their way and let's get right into segment number two. Segment number two is a little bit more difficult. It's called Trivia Plus. Let's look at the categories. The categories are the same, science, history, maths and general knowledge, but the point levels are doubled. So. This time, questions are worth twice as much and mistakes cost twice as much as well. Let's see which team performs better and let's see which team the spinner chooses. Look at that. Team A once again. Team A. What is your choice? Get us started. Let's see if you can fill this gap. 
Science, 20. Science for 20 points, please. Which planet is nearest the sun? Team A is buzz first. Mercury. That is absolutely the correct answer. Well done, Team A. Choose again. General knowledge, 20. General knowledge for 20 points, please. Which crop is known as silver fiber? Team B. Corin. Are you sure? Yes, sir. Absolutely correct. Points to Team B. Very well done. Team B, make your choice. Math for 20 points. Math for 20 points, please. What is the name of the manual calculating device which consists of beads? Team A has buzzed first. Are you sure? Yes. Absolutely correct. Team A has now taken it. Make your choice. History for 20 months. Make it a little bit more difficult. You guys are tied neck and neck. Put some space between you guys and Team B. Would you like to go for 40 or stick to 20? No, we, no. we, we want to stick to 20. No risk being taken right now. 20 points. History. That's what you said? Yes. Absolutely. What river valley was home to an ancient civilization in what is now known as the country of Pakistan? Team B. Indus. Indus is the right answer. Very well done. Team B, choose again. We'll go for general knowledge for 40. General knowledge for 40 points, please. Which is the largest country in the world by area? Team B has answered. Russia. Russia. That is absolutely correct. Well done, Team B. Well done. Excellent. Team B is back in the lead. Take your choice. We'll go for maths. 40 points. 40 points. Maths for 40 points, please. What mathematical term is given by the number 3.14159? Team B has buzzed again. Bye. That is the right answer and that brings us to the end of our second round. Team B came into this round leading, Team A caught up and then Team B zoomed forward. Let's have a look at where the points stand after round two. Team A is at, a, at 70 points. And Team B is at 170 points with a commanding lead. Team B, how are you feeling right now? And uh, what's your strategy going forward? Just answer as many questions as we can. That's, and we're feeling really excited. Very nice, excellent. We're focusing on what we're good at and then, you know, dividing our energy into that. I think you're doing a fantastic job. Keep doing what you're doing and this competition's yours. Thank you. Thank you. Team A, what's your strategy? Do you feel like you can bridge this gap? Yes. What, how do you feel like you're going to do that? With 100 points spread, you caught up before. Do you think you can catch up again? We yes, do have we the can. potential. We just have to get better with the buzzer. <laughs> <laughs> of course, you have to know the answer, but you have to have good buzzing yeah. skills as well, so you get the opportunity to answer. Well, that being said, let's take a short break and then get right into round three. See you in just a moment. Are you interested in news writing, photography, storytelling, drawing, sound and music? Zcoms offers specializations in film and TV, communication design, journalism, and a brand new specialization in digital marketing. Consider joining Ziauddin College of Media Sciences, located at Ziauddin University, Clifton. For details and admissions, log on to our website or contact on the numbers given below. Welcome back, viewers. The competition was extremely tough. Team B is in a commanding lead. They're doing their school, TMUC, very proud. But let's see if the kids from Reeds can catch up in this next round. Our third segment is called Entertainment. The thing that's different about this particular segment is that they can either have an image, a question, audio clip or a video clip and then the question will be asked. It'll be a little bit more interactive 
and let's have a look at what the points are right behind me. So in this particular round, the points stand at 30, 60 and 90. So while there's a 100 point spread between Team A and Team B, the points can get much closer and or much further apart very, very quickly. Team A, how are you feeling right now? Are you ready for this? Yes. Amazing. Team B, are you good to go? Yes, yes. sir. I'm sure you guys are confident. 100 point lead. That's a big deal. Let's see what the spinner says and who gets to go first. Team B, you get to start it off. What category would you like to start with? For 30 points. Music for 30 points, please. You guys buzz first the song? and I didn't the... read the question. Okay. So automatically the, uh, the chance goes to team A. The question is name the song and the artist. Team A, do you have an answer? Five seconds left. You lose your free opportunity, risk free, right here, right now. Team A, give us your answer or lose your chance. Anything, nothing, zero, skip. Sir, can I answer? Team A did not know it. Team B, you unfortunately, you can answer but not for points. What were you going to answer? Taylor Swift. Taylor Swift, that would have been the right answer. You lost this opportunity, but you do still have your 100 point lead. So let's see how it goes with the next, next question. Tell us a little bit about your favorite music. Is uh, Taylor Swift one of, uh, one of the artists that you like to listen to? I do like her songs. Very I nice, do, very do. nice. So I guess going into this round, music is probably one of your strengths. Yes, probably. Excellent. It looks like it's getting tougher and tougher for you, Team A. Team B, make your choice and let's move forward. Music 60. Go for music for 60 points. Music for 60 points. Let's stick with the same category. Which Pakistani band is this? Team B is buzz Janoon. first. That is absolutely correct. Very well done. The answer is Janoon. Points to Team B. Team B choose again. Go for sports for 30 points. Sports for 30 points. I won't penalize you for that buzzer. Sorry. Uh, sports for 30 points, please. How many players are there in a basketball team? Team A has buzzed first. Take your best shot half from half court. 11. There are 11 people on a basketball team. Uh, that is not correct, Team A. Team B, would you like to take an opportunity? Six. There are six on a basketball team. It's lucky that you guys have a free hit. That is not the right answer. There are five, five people yeah. on a basketball team. But it's okay, Team B, you don't lose points. Team A unfortunately gets minus marking. Let's keep moving forward. Team B, make a choice. Movies for 30 points. Movies for 30 points, please. Which Pakistani movie is this? Team B is buzz first. Homan Jahan. That is absolutely correct. It is Homan Jahan. Team B got that answer. Absolutely correct. Team A is lagging behind, but we've got three 90 point questions up there. Let's see if Team A can catch up. Minus markings on the table, but if they get them all right, they can still win even now. Team B, what would you like to choose? Music for 90 points. Music for 90 points, please. Which band's album art is this? Pink Floyd. 
That is absolutely correct. Team B smashing it. Team B choose again. Movies for 60 points. Sorry for that. I'm sorry for that. Very, uh, very handsy with the buzzer. It's okay. You don't get minus marking. Next time you do that though, I'll get them to I take 10 points off. <laughs> Uh, what was your choice? Uh, movies for 60 points. Movies for 60 points, please. Which movie's theme is this? I'd say team A, take your shot because if you get it right, you'll get closer. If you get it wrong, well, you're already losing. This is probably our last question right here. None of the teams know the answer. Whoever buzzes first can take a shot. Nobody wants to take a risk right now. Team B is in the lead. Let's call it the end of our third round. Neither team knew the answer. The answer was Star Wars. Team B didn't want to take a risk. Team A could have taken the opportunity if they had an idea, but they unfortunately didn't. Let's have a look at our point totals right now and see where the teams stand. Team A totaled 55 points and Team B had a commanding lead with 350 points, almost a 300 point difference. They are our champions for today and they'll be moving forward to the next round. Very well done, Team B. Thank you. Amazing job. Thank you. thank you. Absolutely, absolutely. Team A, thank you for being here and representing your school. And Team B, of course, fantastic and well done. Ladies and gentlemen, we had some fantastic competition today. The battle was fierce and I've got two fresh teams ready to go neck and neck on our next episode. So I'd love to see all of you there. My name is Faraz Parekh and from all of us here on the Quizcoms team, goodbye, good luck and Godspeed. See you next episode.